Hey guys, Matt Scoggins here with IDI. I'm one of the technical representatives. I got Aaron Meisner here with me. He's gonna do my spraying for me today. Uh, we're up here at our corporate office in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Today we're gonna to show you how to read your foam. I'm gonna show you what cold foam looks like. I'm gonna show you what good foam looks like. And we're gonna show you what hot foam looks like. First, let's take a look at cold foam and what it can do to your business. If you notice, it's gonna have a lot of dripping low yields, have pocketing, and bad adhesion. All this combined means less profit for your business. Now we're gonna show you the effects of foam that's too hot. You're gonna notice a faster reaction. You're gonna see fly foam flying out the wall, which is gonna to lead to lower densities and possible shrinkage. If you notice one of the effects of the foam being sprayed too hot, it is now smoking. This can lead to auto ignition, can burn your project down. If you're lucky enough not to have your project burned down, this has a high potential of leaving a very bad odor into the project for the next years to come. Finally, we're gonna show you the effects of good foam. With good foam, we're gonna see better yields. We're gonna see our proper performance. And in the end, more money for your business. Thank you guys for tuning in to this short video. Thanks a lot to Aaron Meisner here. I'm Matt Scoggins. This is our technical team. If you have any questions, give any one of us a call. We're here to help you.